Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Stephanie and today we are back with another dun dun mukbang beats beats and today we are super excited because we have a giant feast for all three of us to eat together. We've got I think like seven cheesy mozzarella Korean corn dogs with like this giant thing of spicy rice cakes with a cheese with a fried egg on top and I'm so excited. Oh, this one's kind of far. Should I move it closer to us? Let me just... <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Do you think if I put a Cheeto puff in front of it, it'll cut it? It will. <laughs> oh my god! Damn. <laughs> You've seen me do giant Big Macs. You've seen me do giant chicken nuggets. Giant macaroon cake. But have you ever seen me do a giant Chinese <laughs> I'm kidding. It's not that type of video. Today we're going to be making tiny moods. I don't know why this was requested. I feel like the person that requested this video is honestly trolling me. I just saw one comment on my other video that says, please do tiny moods. I'd love to see it. And now the idea is in my head. And I can't get it out. I can't do this. I can't do that until I get this idea out of my brain. I feel like I'm going to do a really good job. And I feel like it's going to be aesthetically pleasing and just super cute looking but at the same time I have the patience of somebody who literally who's somebody who doesn't have patience mm. I bought a book on patience once but I didn't have the patience to read it I'm literally <laughs> kidding that's <laughs> your best joke ever sometimes I like to drink coffee while I'm pouring coffee creamer into it because even the second of waiting for it to mix in and start I don't like it so like I'll literally start drinking the coffee as I'm pouring in the creamer and then I'll stir it with my mouth and I'll stir the straw with my mouth as I continue drinking the coffee because that is literally how impatient that I am. We're making tiny Korean cheesy corn dogs and tiny spicy rice cakes. Now we're gonna cheat a little bit. I'm actually gonna get some raw spicy rice cakes uncooked and I'm gonna shave it down mm. with my super chef skills. I'm thinking of doing a fried egg on top. Am I just gonna do a regular fried egg? Do I have quail eggs? No, I freaking don't. So what I'm gonna do is I have these syringes, okay? Okay, the syringe. <laughs> so I have these syringes and I'm gonna get the syringe. I'm gonna take out the white part, put it onto the frying pan, and then I'm gonna take out a little bit of the yolk, put that on to the frying pan, and it's literally gonna look like just a downsized fried egg. Genius. Boom, bitch. Baboon. Boom, Let me get my shit together. I have this pulled up on my iPad. I gathered all of the ingredients that actually make the authentic Korean cheesy corn dogs. So I'm gonna make a full size batter because who knows in the um, the steamy hotness of this kitchen, I might just end up making some actual big size corn dogs to consume and eat because I'm feeling a little bit hungry. So if you guys are following the recipe, this works for regular sizes. We've got salt, baking powder, sugar, flour, and we need an egg and cold milk. You're doing all of that? I have to. Let me move this headband so I don't look like a Looney Tune. We're gonna need one cup and two tablespoons of all-purpose flour. Mm -hmm. That's really wasteful, babe. I'm thinking we can make some real ones. You think no, I should do tiny batter? No, that's a batter? lot of oil. Mm -hmm. Tiny batter. Should I cut it in fourth? Mm -hmm. That's gonna be so hard. We're just going to do one fourth instead of one cup. What's two teaspoons divided by four? One teaspoon, one half of a teaspoon. Yes. Yes. Wow. Uh, are you actually proud of me? Like that's. But you're actually proud of this is one half teaspoon, okay? What's one fourth of one half of a teaspoon of salt? A tiny little pinch. Take that one. No salt. They want this much salt, mm -hmm. but we're cutting it into fourths. Yeah, then just do one fourth of that. Hey, is this a fourth? A little more. Like this much? No, more. More. And then we're gonna need two tablespoons of sugar, which means one tablespoon, which means half a tablespoon, which is actually not a measurement that we have. So I'm just going to have to wing it. So we're doing one half tablespoon of sugar. I feel like that's good. Add the sugar in there. And we're gonna mix this. But we're not just gonna mix it with a regular spoon. We're gonna use our tiny spoon and mix it like so. What's three fourths of a cup in one fourth? They want three of these in the original recipe, mm -hmm. but I'm dividing it by four. Mm. I couldn't just, <laughs> my brain is. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Do you know the answer? Just a little bit less than that. <laughs> it would be four over one. And then what do they do? They told you in high school that you're gonna need this. After graduating high school, it never used it till now. Mm -hmm. Till now. now. Just do it Chinese way. What just eyeball it? it. No. 
No, no, no. I'm gonna syringe it. What are you doing? I'm literally gonna syringe it. Oh my okay, god. Okay, so I'm gonna throw the egg in. <laughs> so now I'm going to beat this. This is how I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna beat it. Like so. I'm going to get this syringe. Oh boy, that's disgusting. I just have to push oh this God. down until I reach 10. And that's it. Honestly, so that's pretty you. smart, right? Mm -hmm. yep. I don't know if you're being sarcastic. Mm -hmm. I cannot tell. So if I'm supposed to have 3 fourths cup of milk, and now I have to divide that into 4. Mm -hmm. Okay, 3 fourths cup of milk is 0.75. Mm -hmm. Yes. 0.75 divided by 4. It's 0.18. That's one fifth. Yeah. It's about one fifth. Mm -hmm. That means I'm going to do... A little less than one fourth. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And how much less? So 0 0.25 minus 0 0.19 is 0 0.06 mm -hmm. is the difference. Mm -hmm. So four fifths <laughs> full. Four fifths full of a one fourth cup. <laughs> is that good? Too little. Is that good? More. Stop. Can I be really honest with you? Yeah, you The other day I had a lot of um, milk products. Yes. And I have been having flaming hot diarrhea since. I gotta go. I'll be right back. Can you take over real quick? <laughs> take over? I'm not taking over. I guess we are taking over. So we're gonna use this chop, I mean this uh, toothpick. So usually when we make cheese corn dog, we just put a whole stick of mozzarella cheese stick into the batter. But I have some, this baby bell cheese. So I'm thinking of sticking this in like this, and then just coat it and fry it. Go ahead, chop this up into a skinny little cheese stick. It doesn't have to be really accurate, you know. Nobody's really eating this anyways. So go ahead, stick it in. Now we got a little cheese stick. Now, all we need to do is coat this in the batter and fry it. Hi. Anyways, how are the corn dogs? Whoa! Is that so cool? Whoa! Why are you screaming? <laughs> Maybe we can do like um, fried rice. What? What? Wait, what are you doing? I'm about to fry the cheese dog in this. The oil has to be hot enough to fry it. Right, and we're gonna drizzle some oil on there. I'm in shock. Like that amount of oil. What do you think? Wow, this looks so cool. Should I make some fried cheese? Oh my god, we should make some cheese balls. <laughs> Cheese balls. Cheese Look. balls. Yeah, cheese balls. If I coat this ball yeah. into the batter yeah. like this. Cheese ball. And then I throw it into the oil. A boon. Well, for me, Nothing I'm going to be smart and put it on a toothpick. Dip it, lift it up. Dip it, lift it up. Why is it not frying? It's not frying. Yeah, is it's it not hot. hot. It's literally not hot. Huh. Yeah, this thing ain't getting fried at all. All right, that was a fail. For this part, I tried to find the smallest rice cakes that ever existed, and this is the one that I could come up with out of our pantry, and they look like this. But this is all still too big. This is regular people tteokbokki, so we are going to cut it down to at least a fourth of the size that it already is. So okay. just make it even smaller. That sounds cheap. seems pretty easy. Wow, it's hard. So I'm going to cut it into thirds right now. Shave it to look like a duck. You know what I mean? My biggest problem is that it's just turning out looking rectangular. What the heck are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, so you're going even smaller. Okay, let me go even smaller. Let me cut this in another half. I mean, tteokbokki is just rice cake. You can literally cut it into any shapes, no? No, but like, tteokbokki traditionally is eaten in the shape. Okay, I'll make it smaller then. Okay, me too. So okay. I'll just cut it in half. I'm hungry. Good, because we're making food. <laughs> Wait, are you gonna eat it? Yeah. What do you think of this set? Oh, that's tiny. It looks like the booger that was in your nose the other night while we were watching TV. Honey? This looks like the booger that was in your <laughs> nose the other night. I don't have tiny plates. <laughs> that seems like something that my dumb ass would have, no? This? What is that? I mean, I guess you can cut, cut the... Cut the rim off. Yes, make it like a to-go. To-go, double How did they make it look so, like... Peaceful and artsy, and I'm over here literally about to get my finger sliced by plastic. They're probably not that fun to make. Even when they're making it, they're probably like cussing. And, <laughs> and then just take out the Yeah, audio. take out all the audio and play like cute little music. Mm -hmm. It's very shallow. Bro, I thought you wanted it shallow. That's, That's actually cool. so cute. How much is that? This right here? Yeah. This is $20. 
putting it down. Yes. Oh my god, and then we can cut chop er, toothpicks into chopsticks. Okay, that's really cute. Is this ready yet? The oil? Should we test it out? Please fry. No. Okay, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe this is not gonna work. We need to do it on the stove with the real pot then. This is our setup. We've got our lineup of cheese corn dogs. The broken one is obviously mine. Some shit went down, okay? You do this, correct? Yes. You wrap it up. Okay, throw Wash it in. Wash your hand. <gasps> oh! Wow. That's really cute. That's cute. Oh my god. Oh. oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, it's splattering everywhere. Okay, I think I can just grab one of these. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, don't uh, use your hands. Oh my god, here. How many burns do you have? Ah! Okay, I think it's done. Yeah. <laughs> That's actually very, very cute. Oh, look at this little thing. Sugar, sugar, sugar. sugar. <gasps> Can I eat it? Can I eat it? <laughs> What's the taste? Mm? Mm? Just like that, all of my hard work is gone. <laughs> it's freaking gone. It's really good. Now we only have seven left. <laughs> All we did was fry up little corn dogs, but the amount of oil circulating in this kitchen, I had to put my freaking hair up. It's intense. So let me show you what's been going on. These are the corn dogs. They look more like shrimp tempura than they do corn dogs, but I think that's all just part of our big plan, you know? This is now our new tteokbokki thing instead of the circular. See, this looks bootleg. This looks so fancy. Bootleg. Fancy. Hi everyone, welcome back. So I'm taking over this tiny kitchen because I was gonna say, so <laughs> I don't know why anytime there's the word tiny or giant, I feel the need to make sexual remarks and I'm not gonna do it anymore because I'm 25 four guys. I need to make a teeny weeny fried egg. And how do you do that, we ask? Well, here's the thing. I'm gonna take the yolk, separate it from the egg whites, using my bare hand that I just washed about five hours ago approximately, but who's counting? And I'm going to put the egg yolk into a separate little container. A little bit of olive oil and really let that heat up. That was really a lot more than I feel like I work at a Michelin star restaurant and I'm cooking a $200 main entree and it's just the tiniest little thing in the world. That was really risky. I think I'm going to put these little rice cakes into a little bowl of water and start freaking microwaving them. And into the microwave it goes. While that heats up, you're gonna wanna grab your brush and really brush the oil. It worked! It literally has cooked all of the rice cakes. Grab a good amount of egg white, make an egg shape. I'm gonna do a couple of these, just in case some of them get messed up. That's a good size. That's all mucus. <laughs> That's the grossest noise I've ever heard. I wonder if people that are watching this think this is actually very relaxing and pleasing to look at, or if it's disgusting. <gasps> that I'm literally squirting around egg whites with a medical syringe. <gasps> Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. What are you doing? Oh, Is that, that cute? That's kind of cool. Those are all egg whites? Yeah. I'll be back in 10 hours when these bitches are done cooking. <laughs> Ew. Now I'm gonna microwave the tteokbokki sauce. Don't do it, don't do what I think you're about to do. You have no patience, sir. And how come my egg turned into a three eggs over there? I gotta mix the tteokbokki sauce. You're so clumsy. Oh, okay, that looks okay. That looks, oh, that actually looks good. If you zoom in, it looks full size. Can we put the egg on there? Put the egg, put the egg. Oh my oh, God. Oh boy. Oh my God. <laughs> How do you melt the cheese? How much cheese? A good amount of cheese. A lot of cheese. No, like, I mean, this is okay. mini tteokbokki at the end of the day. Yes. Massive amount of cheese. Damn. Wow, beautiful. Oh my, oh god. my god, this is oh extra cheese on a tteokbokki, guys. Extra cheese. Wow! That looks legit. Wow! That's so So dope. we've got the tteokbokki, we've got the corn dogs. Let me just set up for my mukbang. I'll be right back, guys. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Stephanie and today we are back with another dun, dun, dun. Dun. Mukbang Woo. Beans Beats and today we are super excited 
excited because we have a giant feast for all three of us to eat together. We've got, I think, like seven cheesy mozzarella Korean corn dogs with like this giant thing of spicy rice cakes with a cheese with a fried egg on top and I'm so excited. So I guess without further ado, here are some chopsticks for you. <laughs> Thank you. And for you. Oh, this one's kind of far. Should I move it closer to us? Let me just. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Ready? So, um, I guess uh, let's just dig in. You know, I forgot something. I forgot. <sighs> the ketchup. Ketchup. <laughs> of course. So, we're going to just put um, a little bit. Oh. Wow. You're more than welcome to eat the cheesy corn dogs. Cheers. Cheers, guys. Cheesy corn dog. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a look. Would you like one? <laughs> Wow! Wow! Tastes just like corn dog. Wow! I'm <laughs> gonna try the notebook here. Mm. Oh, look at this kid on. <laughs> I'm gonna try this notebook. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> this is what I call big bite. <laughs> <laughs> it said. Oh my god! Tastes just like notebook, though. Oh my god! It really, yeah. literally does. Yeah. Oh my god! It did. Like the Alright, I'm gonna give you guys a big bite. Okay. Check this out. <laughs> Three the bookies. Oh, oh shit. Oh, wow. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stop coming for all the mukbangers' careers. You know what I mean? You need to tone it down, you know honey. What? Just because what? you said it. Yeah. I'm gonna do four. Four? Oh, wow. shit. Are you gonna be hungry afterwards? Alright. Uh -uh. Well. What about a cheesy bite? Uh, oof. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 and I got two duck bookies. Here, I'm gonna yeah. one bite, one corn dog. You want a big bite challenge? Oh. Cheesy corn dog eating contest. Three, two, one, go. Done. Mmm. I got swallowed. Done. Done. Too slow. What? <laughs> I feel like I can't even tell a story in this mukbang because. Why? Because we're so hungry. Yeah, there's like That's a food left. Let's the cheese. Ready? Hun hao chu. Hun hao chu. Hun hao chu. Hun hao chu. What does, what does that mean though? Hey, it means yummy. It's like my shit's ah. You think my mom's saying literally, we're doing whatever we're doing and you're just fucking eating this spicy rice cake? I don't think he cares. Yeah, like yeah. really. That's well, good stuff. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed today's mukbang. I know that it was a lot of food. We did a lot more eating than we did talking for once, which is kind of crazy. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed watching us eat this delicious feast. Are you full? I'm full. High five. Up top, bitches. Oh. I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Thank you to my studio audience, mother. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. 